good, Joe. Welcome back to a brand new comic rant. This time we got the first annual for Black Cat. Now, I had to do some digging with this one because I was kind of confused on what the hell this like infinite uh, distance destinance was or whatever basically so from the little research i did it was basically them it's basically like some event from that's going to be going on through the annuals that's working in tandem with black cat where basically the marvel heroes are looking for the infinity stones that's basically the gist of it and so but this also says it includes part three of infinity I infinite fury by the way the first two are other black cat issues issues eight and nine i think which, eight, yeah eight and nine which are not out yet so yeah so yeah releasing the third part before even the first two parts are even out or maybe this is his own separate issue and it's gonna include that shit at the end of it i don't know how this is gonna work but let's just jump right in i'm gonna have to take off this hoodie because it's really fucking hot all right all right Credits. Next page and next to come. I don't know if I mentioned this uh, earlier, but we know if you guys, you guys get to know Moon Knight's gonna be getting a new series and um, Jade, what the hell is her name? Uh, uh, Jade McKay, McKay is gonna be the writer for. Well, you guys know is currently white Brian Black Cat, so she's gonna be able to write Moon Knight. So I'm curious to see what she does with it. Should be interesting. This I've been really digging the Black Cat run so far. So see how she does with Moon Knight whenever that drops. Still need to kick off. Still need to read those Avengers issues that were Moon Knight made appearance of, because it's gonna be bouncing off of that. So you gotta read those eventually. But anyway, look, look. Here's the thing. Life's been difficult for me lately. Lots of drama. Lots of tears. Lots of almost getting Manhattan pulled into a money hot hell. So I figured, uh, so I figured on a vacation. Fun in the sun. Meet new and interesting people. Steal their stuff. You know. Which makes, which makes game, which makes game pinched on a, on a on a stopover in at Inchino Airport, really embarrassed. Who are you supposed to be? The White Fox National Intelligence Service. Well, I'm the Black Cat. I know who you are. Next page. I don't know the design of, of this chick. What was her name again? The White Fox or something? What was it? Yeah, the White Fox. Alright, next page. I've got, I've got, I've got you cold on entering, on entering this this country with falsified credentials. You and your little friends. You'll never take us alive, Cooper. <laughs> of course, they are. They this could all go away. Go on. How do you feel about doing a job for the Republic of Korea? Just you. It will be worth your while. Now you're now you're speaking my language, lady. I've worked. I've I've got a work ethic like you would like you wouldn't believe. Then I'm always get so bored during layovers. You've got yourself an accomplice, G lady. I really do did this did design for this too. It looks really fucking cool. Anyway. So we're all so we so we are so we are, so where are we going? Glamorous party, some some submarine base. Hit me with a super spasso. In a moment, first I have to take your temperature. Temperature for what? Ah! No, you're right. I lied. That wasn't taking my temperature. That wasn't taking my temperature. No, you're right. I lied. That was a trans. That was a translo. That was a translator. Yeah, translate translator implant. Congratulations. You now understand Korean. <laughs> you lied. I'm a super spy. I lie all the time. Try to keep. Yeah, I don't think I like many parts. Yo, I gotta say, I love the art. Whoever they got drawn Black Cat, fantastic. Especially in the most important area. Yeah. Anyway, the job. Tell me about the job. I lead. I lead Tiger Division. The NI. The NI. The NIS. NIS superhero superhuman response team. Do you know about Tegu? Teguki? Teguki? One of our heroes? Sure, the Korean hi this Korean Hyperon, right? Heaven heavy hitter? We prefer to call him Hyper Hyperon. The Amer the American ta Tagaki ta Tagaki. Regardless, he is strong, invulnerable, can fly, etc. Patriot, hero, and the heart of our team. He is also he is he's also been compromised. So we're doing some spy shit. 
compromised. Isn't this isn't this guy on par with the black with blue mirror with blue marvel with the sentry? A gangster family called Chio Faction, I probably butchered that, claimed to have to have him under their control. A superhuman with Taga, a superhuman with Tagaki's power it let loose let loose on this on a city with the population density of so it would be apocalyptic. Their demand <laughs> Hold on. They're demanding that the, the government seize control of them, or they'll, or they'll unleash Tega, or they'll unleash Teguki on Seoul. As we're here with the, uh, the city's population density, Seoul, it would be apocalyptic. Not to mention that he's a national icon. Damn this art video. I'm gonna have to check the credits page again after I'm done with this, because I need to know who, who's drawing this. So a bunch of gang so a bunch of gangsters have you have, have your strongest superhumans under their control, and they want to turn the country into a gangster dictatorship with them on top. Is that is that about is that is that is about the state of it? So what's the pay? So what's the pay? You will not be paid. Now I lied again. That wasn't that was that wasn't just a translator. It was a bomb too. Oh shit, bombs. Damn, it was also a bomb. All right, Bur Bursam Bumasan Mountain Tiger Division Base. Later, look. All I'm saying is that you deserved it. That was a sucker punch. So blow my head off, then why don't you? I told you, it's just a na a nanomutation. You would bleed internally. And if you think I was going to tell you the tell you a horrific state secret without some insurance, well, Black Cat. Thank you. Next page. Meet Tiger Division. Right. I like the designs of these here, especially the woman with the black hair, with the white hair in the back, and the chick with the eye patch on the, on the, on the left, on the right. Oh, they look cool. I like the designs of these guys. The General. The totem that walks like a man. Mr. Enigma. Unlikable, unkillable brawler, god of soul, of the, of the soul streets. Luna, so, Luna Snow. Cryo... Cryotinetic, cry, cryon, cryotinetic pop pop star and agent of Atlantis. Only here for emergencies. Shit on my screen. Gunru two, robot rookie with a big with big shoes to fill. Anti uh, ant anti ant ant. I don't know. I said, probably uh, ant. I don't know. I say that. Canary. Yeah, can, can, canny g gambler, some sorceress with dark, with di with dick of magic, of magical playing cards, older than she looks. <laughs> next page. Hey team, do you guys have bombs in your next two? Ha, <laughs> I do, but uh, but it was, but it went out, but it went off with just a little trick. You said it was just a little uh, nano machine. Yours is, little, yeah, nano -mation. Yours is. We're trying to control an, an industrial demigod with a bad attitude and a thirst for so soju. As it turns out, we we just we just had to keep supplied with the with drinks, keep him supplied with drinks and fights. Speaking of which, Tiger Division, we're looking at we're looking at the fight of our lives. Next picture. We've tracked we've tracked the, the the Cho faction transmission to the to the abandoned Alps Alpsky resort. Mr. Enigma, General Luna Snow, Luna Luna Snow, Snow, Aunt, Auntie Ant, and Gunnar will go will go hot or cold. Sure, while we ex while we expect the fact while we expect the faction to have men have men there, it's Tageki, Tagaki. <laughs> Teguki, Teguki, I don't want to keep saying like Tagaki enough. <laughs> Teguki, that you'll probably have to go up against. I know Teguki is your is our friend, but he's under enemy control, and that makes him the most dangerous man on this on the on the peninsula. He's not the hero you know. He may very well try to kill you. While you're while you're providing a distraction, Black Cat and I will infiltrate the resort, discreet by what by what means they're they're controlling Teguki and neutralize them. Any questions? Hmm. Yeah, yo, black head looking fun in that panel. Mm -mm -mm. I have one. Why bring the foreigner? <laughs> Why bring the foreigner? <laughs> Next page. Later. 
The white fox silenced her with a glare. Then I get I get the feeling that she doesn't like having her authority challenged. But then, but then I re I really look at the, at the at their team. But why? But I was asking the same question. Why me? Spy, pop star, wild wild man, robot, Merlin, and whatever this thing, whatever that thing is. I wonder if these guys have made appearance in other comics. I really dig their designs. If you guys know of any other comments these guys appeared in, you know, write them down in the comments. Because I'm actually kind of curious to see if they have any other appearances in the Marvel U. Probably. They're probably some super obscure books. <laughs> A pack of powerhouses for sure. Yo, I know I keep stopping, but yo, black like, yeah, looking good in this comic. I'm, sorry. I'm just saying, man. She looking fine. A pack of powerhouses for sure. But we're going up, we're going up against gangsters with a, with a ha hammer, with a hammer. With then with that hankering hankering for court for coops coops and when you're going uh, when you're going against crooks you want someone who you can who you th who can think like a crook because they are one and when the crooks land on the on the do on your on your doorstep well ready born ready I walk through the cherry blossoms lady near as I can get near as I can get you is the as the outskirts of the resort That'll be fine. It's your lucky day, then. Next page. What? Well, that sure. Well, that sure beats the parachute. Sure beats a parachute. Quiet. You'll t you take me to the nicest places, Whitney. That's not very good nickname. You can't call me Fox. There are a lot of bad. There's a lot of bad baggage there. You don't want to get into. Oh yeah, Fox. Yeah, yeah. Next page. Yo, she legit turns into a fox. She looks like the like fucking nine tails, like with there with all that. What tails is that actually? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, maybe nine. She might be a nine tails. <laughs> when did that be got funny? Naruto reference. <laughs> it's laughable. It's laughably. It's laughably easy breaking in. I thought the guards must have been must have been asleep at first, or just incompetent. At first, but then we found all the blood, the bro that broken nose, hot penny, hot penny smell everywhere, and then we found where some of the blood came from, the slaughterhouse stink all over it, like it had, like it had soaked in, like it had soaked into the very structure of the resort. It wasn't hard to track the source, track to track, you had to track to its source. Er, when did this guy, when this girl from a spy movie to a slasher flick? Shut up, something's wrong. Because I am way too precautious to survive slasher movie. The slasher movie. Just say it. None of this, none of this makes sense. These are all, these are all Chiho, Chiho faction gangsters. I'm getting, a, I'm getting hit on facial recognition off of each of them. Mr. Chiho, Mr. Chiho is here, the boss. What happened? Did someone, did someone hit them before us? I don't know about that. Next page. <laughs> okay, we got some giant explosions going on, but I but I bet the rest of the team has run into your boy into your run into your boy. Uh, uh. Did 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 we stop him? Was it that easy? No. Stay sharp, girl. No need to worry. You didn't scratch me. The body is this body is very resilient. Mr. Chiho wanted me to help to help with him with this ridiculous coup and put him put him in command of the ma of this magnificent body. But with this power at my command, I don't have to listen to anyone. Next page. So come on then. Nice. Next page. They don't stand a chance, do they? No. That's why we had to end things here before they get to take. We get taken apart by an angry god. I just don't understand. Taguki is under someone else's, someone's control, but all the enemies are dead here. All the enemies are dead. We need to find who's in control. Follow the light. You want my theory? It was, it, it's what I, it's what, it's what, it's what I brought you along for. It's not, it's not, it's not as if nanomunition implants are cheap. Har har. I think your Cho faction figured out figured out how to mind control Tagaki Taguki. 
But this new Taguki, whoever he is, I don't think he wants to play ball. After all, haven't you, haven't you ever wanted to murder your boss? Of course. I work for the government, after all. <laughs> <laughs> Next page. Oh shit, we got someone on the roof. No way, was that a joke? Look out! Ah! You know what? On second thought, go ahead and throw me in jail for illegal entry. I'm just about done with this. Be careful, the knife wounds on the on the dead gangster. It matches. These are the mate these are maidens. A mer I'm a mercenary death cult from Daegu? Daegu? I probably butchered that. So apologies. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm from Queens. Hey! So hey, so Felicia's also from Queens, like a boy Pete. Okay, okay. I actually didn't know that. I actually did not know Black Cat was from Queens. That's kind of crazy. I didn't know she was actually from Queens. That's actually kind of cool. That's cool. I guess you can add that into another layer of the relationship. Like, hey, they're both from Queens. That's cool. That's cool. Jesus. Come on! Oh, Jesus. And this, once again, this art is fantastic. I don't know what that means. Forget it. Let's rage. Next page. Alright. <laughs> This dude's just going ham like he fucking Omni Man. Black Hat's doing a thing. <laughs> this dude's doing his Beth Death in the Family impression. Black Hat's doing her thing. And this man's still going at him like he's Omni Man. <laughs> Next page. Damn. Damn. Though. Like, like Black Hat's doing her thing and these guys are just getting the ass kicked. Ooh, I like that man right there. Next page. The second to last one. <laughs> Yo, Blackhead's suit's been torn to shit. You didn't tell me they were superhumans. I thought you liked surprises. Got to be, got to be some answers around here. Huh. Well, I, I bet this is it. No, for us now, now for some insurance. Yo, I got your guy. Hmm? Next page. <laughs> this fat dude is fucking Korean, fucking America. Korea's Captain America, or there's Superman. Manga, manga. But he's not. He, but he's supposed to be dead. This is your big G villain. He's kind of underwhelming. Yeah, it's just like some fat dude in, a, in just in his boxers. What the fuck? He's a he's a psychic cuckoo boy. He's a psychic cuckoo, a body thief. He can he can project his consciousness on out and possess the body of another, but he's never been powerful enough to take over Taguki. Whatever, no, don't kill him. Why not? If you kill him, he his consciousness will remain in Taguki's in Taguki forever. We'll never be able to fix this. Hmm. Okay then. Uh, wake up, wait, hey, wake up, jerk. Just start shaking his shirt. The famous Tiger Division. Broken beneath my feet. Hmm? Something is interfering with my body. White Fox, I thought I missed you back there. And you have a foreigner friend as well. Where is Taguki? With what's left of the rest of your team? You know my visitations leave the host unconscious afterwards. But still, where, where are you? But stay where you are. If you take one more step towards me, I will re... I will re... I, I will retreat to Taguki's body, or perhaps I will take one of yours. Go nuts, pal. I've got a bomb in my neck, and, and I'd lay odds she does too. Shh. Enough lying. This is, this, is car, this is cards on the table time. You were working with Mr. Chiho, right? The gangster who wanted a coup? Next page. Of course. He was cooking up this little scheme, this coup, for a long time. He faked my death, so... Supplied me with the drugs to increase my power. But when I was in Taguki's body, it was an experience like you couldn't believe. The power. But you planned to, be, to betray him all along, didn't you? That was, that's, why they, that's why you hired the creep, the creep ghost lady to back, to back you up. To kill all the Cho fam fra faction boys. Of course, I have no interest in politics or leadership. I care only for the power. I care only for the, I care only for the before the power and the abuse of it. I have no desire to turn this country into a dictatorship. No, with Taguki's power, I think I shall, I shall make it a living hell. 
I'm sure someone will stop me. But you... But how many will I kill before that? And even then, Taguki will be forever ruined. For a good man to be forced to be forced by a pa to be to, uh, to be forced to be a passenger in his own body, while it, while it is me to commit such atrocities, I really I really I really must thank you. Beating Tiger Division into unconsciousness was a delight, but I forgot to leave anyone to gloat over. Your presence here has helped me correct this out this, out, this oversight. Oh shit. Now, I think you're like about the bottoms. Perhaps I shall take the foreigner's body for a spell. Make you kill your pretty friend, or be killed by her. Wouldn't that be delicious, White Fox? Next page. Fight him, fight, fight him, fight him with everything you have. I don't want to, I don't want to blow your nanomations. Because we're from, because we're friends. Say that, say that we're friends. Be serious for once in your life. Never mind, you're, never mind, you probably just lie. See, Mong, see, Mongo, see, Mong Dal, the white fox. She's a super spy. She lies all the time. But I wasn't lying about the neck bombs. I've got one. She's probably got one. And while you were sleeping, and while you were sleeping before she got here, well, I didn't want to make you, I didn't want you to feel left out. How did you? How? It, I'm me. You didn't. I did. Pow. <laughs> Damn. Was his head going to explode? Uh, boo. Let the man's head explode. Boo. I want head explosion. Boo. Boo. Nanomiations. I've been, I'm beginning to see why you like them. Why? Why didn't you kill him with it? Why didn't you kill him immediately? Relax, that's why you brought me, right? I know his type. I've seen him a hundred times. He's a talker. Was a talker. No way he'd pass up an opportunity to monologue at us. Like a, not, not a creep like that. Besides, I wanted to see if you'd stay, say we're friends. Anyways, I, I, can I get back to my vacation now? You know, I really wish you would. Next page. All right, we got the Infinity Stones. Okay, so Soul Stone is nobody. Star has this Reality Stone. Oh yeah, right. I think it's like Inner or something from the Captain Marvel books. I remember correctly. I never ended up reading that Star book, but I think she has like the, the Reality Stone like inside her or some shit. Let me let me look at these captions real quick. Okay, the power by the use of reality can return the phone life. Okay, power by the man. Use the mastery of time can allow for a of a diverse star, the mind stone, and the power stone. Over time has the, has the time stone, and quantum has a space stone. I don't even know half of these characters. Alright. Yo, what's with this art style? Yo, okay, I love he kind of fucks with this. Alright, so let's read. Let's see what we got here from part three. I gave Cap I gave Cap the soft cell. The infinity stones bound it to people. Bound it to people? That next got me shocked. The others on the on the uh, on the abandoned index. Your galactic, your your shrew, your sham your sham shams, Garoth, they're predictable. Having them show up on your doorstep isn't ideal, as it usually signals impend impending demise of your species. Uh, of your of your species, but at least you know what to expect. But this this bonding business, it's new, and I hate it. I hate not knowing, because that's Fury's job, knowing things that that don't that no one else does, not knowing what to what to expect, not knowing what to do. That's how mistakes get made. That's that's how people get dead, usually in tall numbers. The last Fury made enough of those mistakes. I don't aim to follow in his footsteps. Yo, I love this art style. Yo, 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 who's the artist? I love it. It's more like painted, like Pascal or whatever type of art style. It's really cool. Who's the artist? Juan Fer... Ferrier? 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 I probably butchered your last name, fam, but shout out to you, Juan. Your art style is the shit. I actually follow this dude on Twitter. <laughs> I actually follow him on Twitter because his art style is really fucking clean. I don't know where the Infinity Stones came come from. I don't really care if we're being honest. 
and I care what I care about is the threat they pre represent to the planet. My planet. And now they're attached to people. And if there's one thing that this business has removed from has removed my faith in its people. Take ba take Batsu Tisa for for instance. Death row inmate out there with the power to stop time. I just just what just what just what I need. What's next? Victor Von Doom with the Mind Stone? Norman Osborne, the Soul Stone. And on my and on top of that, my mystery my mystery person's trail just has disappeared from the data of Dave Streams while I cross while I cross Kentucky airspace. Next page. That could mean a few things. Best case scenario, they're dead, and I don't have to worry about them anymore. Much worse scenario, they're laying low, running silent, pre precisely to avoid leaving such a trail. But why? What spooked them? It's not as if they could feel they could feel my feel me watching them, could they? No way. No one's that good. But if someone was and if I and I have to assume that I have to assume someone could be, then they would then it would follow that they're watching me now. Oh shit, there's a bomb, C4! Next page. Boom! That is Yo, shadows of the colors and the arts, they're both fuck. All done. Skip the next page. Alright. There we go. But yeah, shout out to the artists and the colors, man. They both did a fantastic job here. Ugh! Amazing. You're still trying to get up. No, no guns, Fury. You're very good. When I realized that my inquiries about Texas had had raised some red flags, I was wondering what kind of man you were. We're going to find out, you and I. Because I think you may be just be just you may you may be just the type the kind of guy I need. Who is this guy? Like the Green Goblin or something? The King? Oh, it looks cool. Yo, Amazing Spider-Man Annual Number Two. Yo, who does this cover? Who did this cover? I have no. Yo, whoever did this cover, man, it is amazing. Star looks great. Spidey looks great. Fantastic, man. Fantastic. Anyway, guys, that is where I'm going. That's where the that's the end of the issue. And overall. This issue was fucking awesome, and I love this issue. It was really, it was really fun. The artwork was fantastic, man. So, like, hold up before we end this video off. Let me go and check out who the artist is, so I can, so I can shout this man out, so, and give him his due props. The artist was Joey Vasquez. Shout out to you, man. Your artwork's fan. And from because of how great his artwork was in this issue, I am going to give this issue a 9.5 out of 10, guys. So anyway. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Would like if you did, subscribe if you're new. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter for like if the links down in the description box below. And as always, come back for more. See you guys next time.